Hey guys, Pastor Zach here. I know it's been a while since I said I was going to do a sermon video, but I finally got a sermon for you. As you can see, this light here. Woo! That sucker's bright. LEDs. In John 8 12, it says Jesus is the light of the world. This light right here has a very unique story behind it. A couple weeks ago, I was driving through Mount Carmel. It was at night, and I saw this guy in a wheelchair, electric wheelchair, going down the sidewalk, and he had very, very low um, LED lights on his wheelchair, and I barely could see his lights to begin with, and God all of a sudden popped in my mind this flashlight, which I didn't even realize I had in my trunk. And I mean, it was shaped just like this. Well, it was the exact one. But I didn't know it was in there. I didn't even know what the shape of it was or anything. And God's like, you need to give that to him. I was like, okay, I don't even think there's a flashlight in my car. So I pulled off to the side of the road, a um, few blocks behind him got in my trunk and long behold this flashlight was right there and I thought wow God that's awesome so I got back in my car had the light in my hand drove a few blocks and I said sir I don't know who you are but I feel that you need this light the guy said no no I don't need no light I said my lights work just fine on my wheelchair I said Sir, I said, your lights are real dim. I said, you need a bright light so people can see you. I said, I just don't want you to get hit by traffic or anything. So we got to talking. He was a 77-year-old man. Hates the government. He made sure to clearly tell me he hates the church. I don't know what the church did to offend him. He didn't get too deep into it. But he said, if you believe in God, that's your deal. And if you don't, that's his way of thinking he didn't want to talk about God he didn't want to talk about anything else so I thought okay that's fine so I sat there with him for almost an hour just listening to him to hear what he had to say and I told him I said if you're ever out and about again and you want to talk I said I'd be more than happy to talk with you. he's like I ain't got very many people that want to come talk to an old guy like me I said well sir I said I'd be more than happy to He's a real friendly guy. If you ever see him in Mount Carmel, stop, have a chat with him. Didn't get a chance to share much light with him, but I did offer the light to him. And that's what Christians need to do, is to share their light. The light that they have in their heart. And share it with others. We are the light of the world. We have Jesus in our heart. We are the light and we're supposed to let our light shine for others. So take time out of your day. Visit with somebody. Meet somebody new. Go up and just have a friendly chat with them. I know they'll make their day. God bless you guys and hope you stay tuned.